everyone, this is Jim Ross. Welcome to the Three Mile Domination Show. It's again in my car. Anyway, <laughs> I want to talk about golf carts. Great conversation, right? No, <laughs> it came up because I just got done doing some uh, a cut locks and a site visitation audit and a uh, site visitation. <laughs> Sounds like I'm in a custody battle uh, doing an audit at a self storage site. And anyway, we're doing the lock cuts, you know, you don't wanna lug around the grinder and the ball cutters and the locks and the lat, I mean, everything. So I use the golf cart, okay? Oh, for the love of God, have a, have a decent golf cart for your site when you're showing potential customers around your facility. This particular one, yeah. It was like it was from a Mad Max movie. It was just, it was bad. Um, <laughs> I literally took the, the golf cart, packed it all up, was driving down to the gate to go into the facility, and I go to hit the brakes. Well, there was no brakes, so I proceeded to ram myself into their gate with their golf cart. And that was a great impression. Uh, I didn't do any damage, just a, uh, just pissed me off. Uh, anyway, it's just it was just terrible. So, again, the purpose of this one is take a look at your golf cart. Don't take it for granted that when you are showing potential customers your facility and going to their unit and making sure that unit's right for them, look at your golf cart. Is are you putting your best? Is, does it make a good impression? Leave it at that. You know, that's, I always say, you want to see how someone lives and what their house looks like, look at their car, you'll have a, a little window into their world, you know, is it full of trash, does it have a three feet full of McDonald's bags in there, and that kind of stuff, you know, they live like a hoarder in their car, that's probably what their house looks like. Well, to me, same thing as a golf cart, you know, if it's, if it's trash and there's there's rips in the seats, it's dirty, it has all the maintenance crap on there, it's got a garbage can in the back full of God knows what. Yeah, and then you're gonna stick a customer on there to go to their unit. Yeah, it's just it's just it's a bad impression. And and who knows if it affects your units and, and people are not gonna rent from you because you have a dirty golf cart. Who knows? But <laughs> I would not feel comfortable at all having a potential customer and then tooling around every your side to go to the unit and being in a golf cart that's just trashed. Um, and the easiest way to really make it look nice, and again, I know it's used for maintenance, but have your maintenance stuff on the golf cart when you're actually doing maintenance that day, that during that time, whatever. Don't have it on the golf cart any other time, you know? Only for those designated times when you're actually doing maintenance. Other than that, that is your, that's your showcase vehicle, you know, for lack of a better word. That's your good impression. That's, that's, make it clean, make it tidy, make it comfortable. So, you know, but kind of like this. I like it when I have a potential customer in the golf cart next to me when I used to manage. You know, have a conversation, talk. And, to me, it's easier if you have a, if they're comfortable and not, not you know, being really uncomfortable in a really dirty golf cart. They don't want to touch anything. They're just really uncomfortable and it's just, it just seems weird. So, anyway, there's my uh, thought for the moment is take some time uh, to let elbow grease and spit shine your uh, golf cart and make it look nice and pretty and make sure tires are pumped up all that kind of fun stuff and you know for god's sakes just take off all the uh, maintenance items when you're not in maintenance mode make it there for the customer's benefit and your own and go from there all right so again thanks for tuning in and i'll catch you next time take care thanks so much for watching we love to give away free books that will help your self-storage business to pick up your free copy of Self-Storage Domination, the 
actions you must take to dominate your competition, simply go to selfstoragedomination.com.